Hello, my lovely friends. So this is my back to school artivity book. So it's a whole booklet that is full of back to school themed art activities. That's why it's an artivity book. Now, I'm gonna be creating them for all the seasons and all the holidays, but this is the back to school one. And these are just some of the pages completed that are inside the booklet. Now there's two ways you can use this resource. One, you can use this and print it off as a complete booklet. It comes with a rubric, an intro, a title page, a reflection at the end. You can use all the pages in the booklet or you can choose to just pull out whatever ones you want and then um, bind them or put them in a duetang. It's really up to you as a teacher. This whole um, system is designed to use with flexible mediums, so you get to choose what our mediums are going to be used by the students, or you can direct what mediums are going to be used um, for individual lessons in here, or let it be complete student choice. Really, it's up to you. So the other way you can use this is just by using it as individual lessons, which will give you tons of lessons to choose from, all of the different activities that are within this booklet um, and the ones for all the holidays and seasons all have to do with being themed around some of the elements of art and principles of design. So we're just going to take a look at some of these samples. Um, I'm going to do them with you and you're going to see it go me do some of these pages really really quickly and then um, I'm going to show you the full preview of the resource but just check out how cute that is. So this is perfect for grades two to five. You got some directed drawing in there. You'll see me do that in a second. Uh, principle of design pattern. So there's a pattern mosaic. I'll give you little patterns for the kids to choose from and they can assemble it in there. And then again, choice coloring or mediums to color with. It's really, again, teacher choice or you can leave it up to student choice. It's, it's all at your discretion. Um, element of art space. a Zen Doodle artwork, and it'll have all the pattern sheets. You'll see that in the full preview. We'll do a roll and draw in there as well where the kids can create their own and you'll get a whole template that matches this, not just a blank paper. I just didn't have it on hand. I didn't print off all the pages. You'll get some symmetry lessons, so um, you'll get balance that way. And then also there's a radial symmetry lesson in here. There's so many things. You'll get full artwork step by steps to create, you know this one's repetition, emphasis, and so much more. So let's dive on in. You can watch me create these right now. And then I'm gonna show you all the different pages, every single one that will be included in the back to school activity booklet. Use it for grades two to five. Perfect for that, unless you have um, like grade ones that are almost, you know, they're needing something a little bit more um, challenging, then this would be a great resource for that. Again, you can use it as a booklet. You can use it as individual sheets. You could use it as when you're done. You could use it as a warm ups. Whatever you want, it's super flexible on how you use it. If you need to have an art sub come in. You can have these out there because they're very simple and easy to use, but all are tied into the elements and principles, so it's perfect for that. If you have something like um, remote learning happening, you can send home the whole booklet and be done prepping for a while. There's no, um, again, there's no discretion or direction for what art medium the kids have to use, so you can let them use whatever they want to finish off their artworks. And you don't have to worry because everything is tied to the elements of art and principles of design. So easy to send home or use in your classroom. If you're art on the cart, this is totally perfect. You can have ready to go art lessons that are easy to implement but are super engaging and fun with the students from lessons where kids are um, creating their own prompts and picking and choosing different elements to create their own unique art prompt or roll and draws to symmetry lessons, to uh, primary colors. It's all included, so check it out. Let's dive on in. Watch me do some of those worksheets really quickly on Fast Speed because I know you don't have a lot of time. And then you can see at the very end, I'm gonna show you every single page that's going to be included. So let's dive on in.
Well, I hope you enjoyed checking out this resource. If you're interested in where to find it, make sure you go on into the description of this video. I'll have a link right at the very top there where you can find it in my Teachers Pay Teachers store or if you're a member of the Artastic Collective membership for art teachers, which is my art resource library membership, you can also find that link in the description below or search Artastic Collective on Google. Then you'll also find this in your back to school section of your holidays and seasonal part of your library. So check it out there or find it in my Teachers Pay Teacher store right now. You can go grab it and implement it into your classroom the next time you go to school. So find that link in the description below and make sure you subscribe to this channel for more amazing art education tips. Let's make some art.